Howdy kids, Danny B here, a little guitar lesson for you guys, um, I'm going to make a couple of videos on just kind of beginning rock guitar kind of thing, and just so you guys know, I'm tuned down a half step, so basically from standard tuning, all my strings are tuned down one half step, so E flat, A flat, or here's E flat, A flat, D flat, G flat, B flat, and another E flat. So anyway, and uh, I'll uh, I'll have a lesson on why to tune down to E flat and the advantage of tuning down the half step and so on and so forth. So for now, I'm just going to start with a little really basic kind of uh, um, um, approach to beginning electric guitar. So a lot of um, rock guitar stuff is played with just really basic chords. Uh, two note chords usually you can do either with one finger or sometimes just two fingers. These are called, uh, mainly uh, referred to as power chords and it's usually the root and the fifth. So for example in the key of G we're going to have a G and the fifth of G if you know your scale stuff the fifth is a D. So the G, third fret, sixth string, and the D note on the fifth, fifth fret of the fifth string. So there's your basic two note power chord, or a fifth power chord. And there's a lot you can do with just those two notes. Um, obviously in the key of G, again if you know your scale stuff, you can use some other chords of that key to complement that, that root chord. Or if you just want to hang out on that chord alone, you can do a lot of things with it. You can just play. So rhythmically, you just vary which ones you phrase, or how you phrase it, which ones you play the most, and then you can reverse it. So there's tons of variations you can do with just this one little chord. I don't know if you can see this properly, but here it is right here. follow-up or actually a little variation of this power chord. You can add one more finger, uh, basically just the octave, so a higher G after the fifth, so root, fifth, and then the root again, up an octave. So basically we get a stacked power chord. We get fifth, and then the same two notes reversed or flipped over are actually a fourth. So these are two basic power chords, a fifth and a fourth. So the fourths are really easy to handle, you can just play them with one finger. You stack them up together, the fifth and the, and the fourth, and you get a three note full kind of body power chord. So all I'm doing there is I'm just alternating between the low root, the fifth, and the high root. And I'm just kind of making up the phrasing as I'm going here, but you can have a lot of fun with just one one chord on the guitar. You get a half decent sound on the guitar on the amp and uh, just wail away on the power chord. Alright kids, that's it for now. We're going to have some more, more fun lessons on power chords later on.